friends, good morning. We just finished up breakfast. As you saw, we had some cereal and banana this morning for breakfast. Super easy because I'm trying to get out of the house pretty quickly because today is Sunday. It's the Sunday before Christmas, so like six days till Christmas. And I really don't like being in the store on the weekend, just like any time of the year, but especially on a weekend leading up to Christmas. So we are going this morning though because when I went to Aldi on Thursday, uh, they didn't have any more turkeys and I would really like to get a turkey for Christmas dinner. Um, we have a ham, but because we bought a turkey fryer back at like Thanksgiving to fry a turkey, we were like, we have all this oil, we have a fryer now, maybe we might want to fry a turkey. My brother said yes, he'll do it. So we need a turkey to fry. Um, and with a turkey, they're frozen, so I need to get it like and put it in the fridge because it's going to take like four days to thaw out or something. So that is the plan for this morning. I'm about to clean up from breakfast and we are going to all get dressed and head to Kroger to get our like last minute Christmas food items. So how many days till Christmas, Elijah? Six. Are you Elijah? Six days till Christmas. And uh, y'all gonna open your Lego one now or are you gonna wait till we come back? I don't to open it now. Alright, y'all go ahead and open it now. So you got, what's her name? Mia. Mia. If it'll focus on Mia. Elijah, don't move the paper. There's Mia. And then what else do you get? Her stocking. Her stocking. And her present. And her present. And Elijah got this snowblower thing, which also came with poop. Where's the poop? It came with a poop and a shovel to scoop to shovel the poop. Where is it? That's not the <laughs> shovel or the poop. <laughs> That's not it. <laughs> <laughs> Put it on the thing. <laughs> oh goodness, you're putting it on top of the snowboard. Can I have one to present no. my flower cat poops? So silly. Two little poops. Okay, we are going to head to Kroger. Oh, I still haven't put my shoes on. You're super blurry. There it goes. Put your shoes on so we can go. are back from Kroger we got all of the groceries that we needed and hopefully we will not be back in the store until after Christmas um, I need to get everything put away now we did the haul and if you want to see the haul it should be up tomorrow I think this video that you're watching should be up on Wednesday and the haul should be up on Thursday so come back tomorrow 10 a.m. watch that um, but I'm gonna put this stuff away try to fit it in the fridge and then I think I'm gonna make myself some coffee and soon it'll be time to make some lunch
I would uh, say our fridge is pretty um, packed. <laughs> All of the milk. Got the turkey squeezed back there. Got the ham squeezed up there. All of the eggs. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So we are we are packed full. I got it all to fit though, so that's what matters. Kids are playing Legos and Lily wanted to show y'all what is it? A hot dog stand. A hot dog stand that they just made. So the red pieces are the hot dogs that are for sale. Mm-hmm. And we use my skateboard from the Lego Friend dog park for the wheels. Okay, so it's like a hot dog cart. Yeah. Cool. Very cool. They're playing Legos. I'm about to make some lunch in a minute. I gotta take the wagon back to the van because we use that to bring all the groceries in. I've been drinking coffee. This is that Stoke that I bought today at Kroger uh, with the Chobani peppermint mocha uh, oat creamer. It's delicious. So good. I've been drinking that and scrolling down Instagram. What'd you make? I want to. A, a what? A present. A present. A present. Is there something inside? <laughs> the building. You have to build it. I thought it was already built. No. Oh, you have to build the present? What are you building? inside. That's the gift? You're building the gift? Is that what you're building? Mm -hmm. <laughs> this thing. What is it? <laughs> a thing. A thing. It's a Solomon's thing. A what? It's a Solomon's thing. <laughs> it's a Solomon's thing. It's a Thongramus thing. Thongramus? A Thongramus thing? What is that? I want to see it. Are you over here making up words? It's a Thongramus thing. <laughs> you, you keep saying that so confidently, but what does that mean? What is a Thongramus thing? <laughs> This thing is a turtle Smith thing. <laughs> You're silly. Okay, for lunch I'm making mac and cheese and I am using this fun pasta that I got at Aldi. I already added it to the Instant Pot. Will you focus? Look, it's a little green Santa. Um, there's sleighs and a reindeer. But yeah, it was just in a clear package. It looked like this. Um, I usually buy like the Halloween one every year, but this is the first time I've ever seen the Christmas ones. So I've got that in here and I had to measure it out because for my Instant Pot mac and cheese recipe, you do equal parts water and pasta. And this was a little bit bigger than a usual package of pasta. This was 17.6 ounces. Um, usually for a 16 ounce box, that's like four cups of pasta. Um, but this is like four and a half cups of pasta when I measured it out. So I'm going to do four and a half cups of chicken broth. I'm currently bringing some water to a boil in my kettle over here, um, so that I can dissolve some Nor chicken bouillon powder in that. And then I will get that in there as well as a little bit of garlic powder, which I'm almost out of in here. I have more in the top of the cabinet. Some ground mustard and some paprika all of that will go in there and then this will cook for five minutes on manual pressure then when it's done I'll come back and show you I'm gonna add some cheese and some milk or heavy cream or something and then that's it done easy we'll have a cute little Christmas themed lunch
Okay, this is done now. I'm gonna cancel it and then release all of the steam. And then once that's done, I'll come back and uh, show you what it looks like. So I realized that I forgot to put a tablespoon of butter in here. There should have been butter in here, but I forgot it. So it's fine. I'm just gonna add some butter in here first. Um, can you guys see this? No, not really. Okay, let me move this closer. Um, there is still a little bit of liquid in here, but that is completely fine. We don't drain the noodles ever. Um, it just kind of mixes in with the cheese and makes it super good. <laughs> So, I got my butter melted in here now. I should have done that before. It, you know, helps the noodles not stick together. But as you can see, they really didn't stick together. But you gotta have butter and mac and cheese. You gotta, you gotta. So I've got some cheddar cheese here, some mozzarella cheese here, and some Monterey Jack. I'm gonna add a little bit of everything. I'm definitely gonna use up all of this Monterey Jack because it's been in the fridge for a while. I don't wanna use that up. And then I will add a little bit of milk just to get it to the consistency that we want it. And with this, you just want to make sure you don't add all the cheese at once. When you add all the cheese at once, it has a hard time like melting. So the original recipe that I saw said to make sure you add just a little bit of a cheese, a little bit of the cheese at a time so it can all get melted properly. Yes, very soon. Okay, to go with the mac and cheese, we're gonna make some little Christmas themed side. It's, um, what are they called? They're like little Grinches. Um, we need some sliced banana, because the Grinches are gonna be wearing little Santa hats. If you spend any time on Pinterest during the Christmas season, you have probably seen these before. Um, they're really cute. I've never shared them in a video before because every time I see them, I'm like, oh, everybody's seen this. Everybody's done this. Everybody knows what it is. And then I was talking to somebody else and she was like, what are you talking about? I've never seen that. Those are so cute. And I was like, well, I guess I'm wrong. Everybody hasn't seen them. So I thought I would just share them today in this video because um, the kids actually asked for them. So you start with a green grape and then you take a slice of banana and then we're going to take a strawberry, cut off the green top part, and add that on there. And I need a little bit more to, oh, whoops. <laughs> that is not what was supposed to happen. Okay, let's try this again. Don't want to go too far down into the grape. Because we need enough space sticking out of the top to add a marshmallow on top. Okay, and then you just take a little marshmallow and add it on top for the little, little poof ball on his hat. So yeah, I'm gonna make a couple of these for the kids' plates.
like on the thing, like you could grab the stick. They might have had longer sticks, so theirs might not have been toothpicks. But how do you like them? Are they as cute as they as you thought they would be? Yes. Yes. They're ador adorable. Adorable. Yes. And they're yummy. You haven't even tried it yet. They'll be yummy with banana and strawberry and marshmallow and grapes. You like all those things, right? Mm -hmm. The pasta, the ones that are orange, they were red, like more red in the package where they turned orange. But they're still cute little Christmas shapes. You're gonna make a poster? While we watch the movie. Mackie's a lot. Okay. Elijah asked if we could watch something, and I remembered that I recorded Santa Claus is Coming to Town. So we're gonna watch this. Our movie just got finished a few minutes ago. Kids are playing with their stuffed animals. And I am by myself. My Aunt Peggy. She's not really my aunt, but she's been in my life like since I was a child. So we call her our aunt. Um, but her and her husband, Steve, were coming over to give the kids some Christmas presents. I don't know that I'll film it, but I'm sure if they open the presents, she might want them to wait till Christmas. But if they open them, um, they will show you what they got. But yeah, we're not doing much. Just chilling right now watching them play with their stuffed animals that they get yeah, all lined up they're getting ready for christmas eve because they're having a big party with um the ones that can sing are gonna sing their songs so um carl will sing let us know um mackie will so this is carl and he will sing let it snow and his Penguins, Molly, Lucy, and Jacob. And um, Mackie will sing Jolly Old St. Nicholas. Um, the Poop will sing his favorite Christmas song. And then I'll just make Rudolph and Claire be there and I'll make them sing. Mm. Is and, Frosty going to sing? Oh yeah, and Frosty going to sing his song. And then lining up. At the Santa, Fast the Santa, Pink Santa, Regular Red Santa, Tiny. He's, little, he's like a gnome Santa. Yes. Yeah. A little gnome. Elf Santa. An elf Santa? <laughs> no, <laughs> this is elf Santa. Oh. <laughs> and that's um, Jingle. Jingle. Mm -hmm. um, My jingle. name is not Hoot. My name is Hoot. Hoot. I'm sorry. I said hoot. It's hoots. I think <laughs> it. I think it's is hoots. a elf. Oh, no, 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 no. Snack time. Mhm. Mm Our um, Aunt Peggy just came and dropped off the gifts. They are not opening them right now. They're gonna wait till Christmas. Henry's gonna have a snack too. <laughs> Henry's gonna have a snack too. We bought Christmas tree cakes today. Oh, where they are? Where they are? Where are they? Uh, we bought these at Kroger today, so they want one of these as their snack. Um, and then if they're still hungry, they can have an apple or something. Henry's having an apple. Henry's having an apple? Mm -hmm. He's having an apple and a cupcake. And then I think they're going to go outside and play, right? I'm going in the backyard. In the backyard and play? And I am going to fold laundry. There's all of this plus some in the dryer. So I'm going to do that while they go outside and play.
laundry is all put away. The kids have been playing in their room. They got all their laundry put away, and now what are you gonna do? Play mommy again. Play video games. They're gonna play Minecraft for now. After dinner, I'm gonna play Sims. She wants to play Sims after dinner. Uh, dinner is going to be easy chicken parm. Yum, yum, yum. And it's 5.30, so I'm gonna start working on that. Somebody come get this dog of mine. Rex. What? Somebody come get this dog. Why? The older he gets, the grumpier he gets. Barking at nothing. Well, not nothing. He knows it's grandpa's car. Look. He likes barking at it. He just wants to bark at everything. Look at his and it just gets worse and worse the older he gets. He's like a grumpy old man. But we love you, Rex. I love you. We too. love you. Even if you are a grumpy old you man dog. You with me all the time, which is nice. But not all the time. Sometimes I just want to be alone and sleep. Most of the time. See? I'm trying to talk and the dog just is barking at nothing. Nothing. There's nothing going on. If it's anything, it's Grandpa getting out of his car. Goodness. Okay, so dinner's done. I cut up the kid's chicken. They've got it on top of their spaghetti noodles. And I said that Elijah requested this. He doesn't request chicken parm, he requests chicken spaghetti. He calls this chicken spaghetti. So, here is our chicken spaghetti. If you wanna see how I make this, come back on Sunday for the What's For Dinner and it'll be in that video. Making our Christmas memories. I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep Yeah, I spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good times with you Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh And I've been longing to hold you close Forget about everyone else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories Come back home to me And when we wake up in the morning I'm gonna play those carols that you love We'll be singing all the melodies Until the sun comes up These are the good times with you Baby, this year is just gonna be So we got that glued on is that, oh, it's finished. This is it. This is your ornament. It's finished. This is finished. Just put it on the tree like this. You got a nice little triangle. And me hang by the fire and chill. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories. Oh, and I've been longing to hold you. Okay, here are the ornaments that y'all just saw us make. This is a little kit that I found at Dollar Tree. What's your name? Um, Nomi McNomerson. <laughs> this is Nomi McNomerson. Elijah, did you name yours? I don't think he named his. Um, this is Lily's. Tasha. This is Tasha the gnome. And then Elijah did the blue one. Yeah. He doesn't have a name. Uh, apparently. Elijah didn't name him. But uh, yeah, those are our cute little gnome ornaments. To add some cute. more ornaments to our tree. Lots of cool we ornaments on there. Yeah, those are part of our um, book. book. 
Christmas book about Jesus. Um, so yeah, we've got the three wise men. That's a Santa ornament. Santa. But we only have hmm, an hour and 20 minutes till okay. bedtime. To play Sims. Lily wants to play Sims. Elijah's doing something. I don't know. Can I play Mario or Mike? Good catch. You cannot eat the cookies if they're raw. Yes, you can. No, you can't. They made it so that you can eat them raw now. How? I don't know. I guess they don't put egg or something in anymore. It says no. it's safe. Please dump up into the tripod. Well, it's not. Let me. It literally says safe to eat raw. Yeah. Even if it didn't say that, though, I would still eat it raw. Why? Because I like it. You want one? Yes. Here. Here. Why is it safe to eat raw? Because they made it so you can eat it raw. Watch out. But is it actually safe? Yes. It's hard to tell what's going on here, but this is their Lego city. This is the farm. A farm here. This is um the thing for the sheep to get water that I showed you, but I added this so they can get to the water. Like this shoots out the water. Okay, what else? The skate park. The skate park. Mm -hmm. Um, Scar's house. House. And he has a garage to park his. Car, and it even has this. Mm -hmm. Put his wheelchair like this. Have you shown mom the thing that can go on the back of it? No, because it doesn't. This is the police station? No, this is the hospital. The hospital? This is a crib for when they get a baby. Okay. What else we got? Um, we have. The bridge and the Lego Friends thing, so the cat grooming thing, and the dog park. Mm -hmm. What's this over here, Elijah? It's a big Grand's house. house. Grand's house. And this is a shop, and this is a shopping cart. Oh, okay. And then we have a fork, and oh, no, this is a potato not. masher. A potato masher? Yes. Okay. What's over here? What's that? That's Gemini's house. Gemini's that house? And that's the pool, me. right? But what happened to the pool? Um, it got drained out. It got drained <laughs> <Yeah>. out. <laughs> so you got beach, like, lawn chair, <laughs> chairs to lay in the sun in, but no no pool anymore, apparently. Yeah. And, um, is it under construction? That's why this, this yeah. is here? And um, it's outside. Yeah, I saw that. That Lego box is outside. We need to... The diamonds. Oh, the um, diamonds yeah. store, the gems, the gem store? Yeah. Yes, Dad, mm. look, he brought me all these, a sled and some skates, and he brought me some skis.
Okay, kids went to bed and it's now 10. I've just been sitting on the couch scrolling through Instagram and TikTok, but I think I'm gonna make myself some peppermint tea and put some peppermint mocha creamer in it and then play some Sims maybe or wrap some Christmas presents. And I think Andy and I are also going to watch a new episode of Dexter because I think there's a new one. And that's gonna be it for tonight. So I wanted to go ahead and end this vlog so I didn't forget to end it. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you leave us a thumbs up and I will be back tomorrow with the grocery haul and Friday with another vlog. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.